Hey everyone, Steven here, aka Haywire, and today we're going to do an unboxing of Geek Fuel. I decided to kind of branch out from my regular loot crates and one up boxes, things of that nature, and kind of go towards boxes I haven't, you know, looked at or gotten before. So, this is my first Geek Fuel box. I'm not exactly sure what to expect. Um, not sure if they're using even a theme. I ordered this so long ago, I'm not even sure if there was like a different plan, but I'll let you guys know in the comments below. Um, and with that said, let's get it open. So, let's cut this up. Try not to cut ourselves, so I'll do this as well. Alright. Alright, let's see what she got for us. Okay, so, first of all, this was the wrong way. I opened it totally wrong. But, still, we're just gonna, like, take that off. And then, this, I'm guessing this is the card that says, hey, this is what's in it. Don't need that right now. So, first up, I usually save the shirts for last, but since it was just, like, staring at me, literally, um, we have, or... Um, it's a Deadpool t-shirt, um, uh, splatter, uh, that's pretty cool, I have a Deadpool t-shirt, but it's like, the one of his belt is on the t-shirt itself, so this one's a little bit more Deadpool-y, <laughs> alright, so we have a book here, and it's called The World According to Spider-Man. So, I mean, it's really a big book, and it looks like it might be a good reel. It's not easy being a superhero, and you got a girlfriend, da da da. Funny enough, I was reading, I was watching Web Warriors last night, and I was reading a comic off of Marvel Comics about Spider-Man and Squirrel Girl dating, so... It's really funny that I get this book, so definitely we'll get into that. Ah, a pocket pop. Oh, where did my focus go? What happened? Oh, there we go. So we got Finn, and I've always seen these in um, unboxings, and I'm like, I want one. And here we go. We got a Finn I can put on my keychain or my work badge or something. I don't know. Anything by Funko is always good. Alright, uh, what else do we have? Kanda. I keep going off screen, my bad. So, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Sour Apple. I'm not a big fan of candy anymore. I'm guessing I can give this away to like my girlfriend's nephew or something because he's into the Ninja Turtles. Uh, what else is in here? So it says, post-apocalyptic currency magnet, start your own nuclear holocaust fund. So this is from Fallout, for those of you who don't know what Fallout is. So, this is your currency magnet. I guess I can use it as a bookmark for when I'm reading this book. Alright, what else? Alright, so as it says, hmm, Ars Awakening, ah, downloadable game and code and teleportation charge, so, hope that didn't get on camera, so, there it is, and, um, I guess inside of it is, oh, so we got some, Okay, so I'm Jamaican, and in Jamaica, what this are, these are called our, um, Chichi Boom Boom. <laughs> you light them up and they pop all over the place. I'm guessing some broke in the process of getting it here to me. So, um, that's unfortunate, but 
still something to scare the neighbors or your cat. Well, don't do it to your cat. That's cool. Alright, and yes, and this is the last thing. Geek Fuels magazine. Um goes into like Comic-Con stuff. Fallout 4, World According to Superheroes, so we got the Spider-Man one, so there's a Wolverine, Batman, Thor, Joker, Iron Man, the Joker one would probably be funny, um, Deadpool trailer review, and, you know, some unboxing videos, people who got featured, um, the Arse Awakening. I'm playing Dragon Slayer waiting on Dragon Hunter to come out. So I guess I'll take a little break from that and play this. And hopefully it's pretty cool, you know. Like, so this is not exactly sure if this is some, yeah, this is a um, gift guy we can buy. So Doctor Who trash can. Don't know why you'd put trash in TARDIS. 8-bit lit lamp, yeah, Star Wars, Sun Reflector, Pac-Man, Racers, 8-bit Warlord, and then we have the Instagram peeps, you probably just you know, got featured, so all in all, I think this was um, a great box, uh, there is, what the mother's Stunner. Okay, so I guess this was supposed to be on the, on this. Yeah, here it is. Yeah, so, I guess it was supposed to look like this. Um, so that is pretty cool. But I'm still using it as a bookmark. I was wondering, I was like, I'm pretty sure this isn't the magnet itself. Like, this isn't the currency thing. Now it makes sense. It was on the side of my box because I flipped it upside down. So, well, thank you guys for watching. I shall be doing a, um, what do I have coming? I have collector work coming. Um, on Wednesday, and then I have a Super Geek Box coming some other time, so look out for those, and I'll see you guys then.